what is up, Schizo fan? What is crack a lock and how's everybody doing? It is Monday, so everybody's probably down, dreary, and saying, I don't want to go back to work. I know that's what I used to do. I mean, uh, on some occasions, because when I drove truck, I didn't have no weekends off, you know what I mean? So even when I drove local, I didn't have no weekends off. Because Saturday, I went to work on the truck, you know, change oil, fill filters, whatever needed done, brakes. And then Sundays, I would wash the truck. So, yeah, I didn't have no weekends off. Oh, well. That's like, but I didn't come here to talk about that today. Anyhow. Y'all, I am... You remember how I was doing the diet thing? Well, I am going to start a 90-day transformation. And I am going to record it. But... I've already been to the gym two days in a row. The first day, I went and, you know, did the stretch thing. You stretched all out. And then I uh, went on the elliptical for a little while, you know. It's kind of like a running thing with the, with the ski handle or something looks like. <laughs> but did that for a little while to get your uh, cardio up your heart pumping and then I worked on uh, shoulders and a um, little bit of triceps and a little bit of biceps but I tell you what I don't know why like what I was thinking on the first day that I went I should have thought about it but I didn't and I went straight to, like, a weight that I could do instead of starting lower, you know what I mean? Because, I mean, if you haven't worked out in a while, like, you don't go to a weight that you know you can do that you've done before and worked out before. Because, you know, when I was working out before and I got to doing this weight, I just, you know what I mean? I did it for a while, so I don't know why I was thinking, well, I'll be fine doing it. Listen... I did, uh, whenever I did my shoulders, I was doing 80 pounds an arm. Well, that night, I figured out, um, no, you shouldn't be doing just jumping straight into it and going 80 pounds an arm. So, I'm probably going to drop down to probably like, I don't know either like 60 or 50 pounds an arm, you know what I mean, and uh, then uh, yesterday, uh, we did, uh, you know, I did the stretch thing and everything, and then I, I did a, almost like a stand-up bike thing, you know, where the bike's like standing out, and then, um, I did that for 10 minutes, and then I did a bike to where you're, like, sitting down. Did anybody see one of the bikes where you, like, sit down, and your feet are, like, almost level with you? And then you do it like that. Yeah, I did that for 10 minutes, you know, to get the cardio up. And so, you know, 20 minutes of cardio. And then I worked on abs and chest yesterday and I had a pretty good day you know but last night and I tell you I was so sore y'all so sore and I can't wait till I get back in it because I remember how bad it hurt for like the first couple weeks until you get back in it I mean if, if anybody has ever worked out a lot before and then stopped for you know what I mean for years you know what I mean and I know here I go with uh, you know what I mean thing like I said guys you probably count that throughout a video you wouldn't believe how many times I say it but anyway um if you've ever stopped 
working out after you worked out for a while and you stop working out and you don't work out for years and then you go back into it like when you get, first get back into it you you remember that pain from when you start from when you first started lifting and working out because it comes right back and then oh, oh my goodness it feels like it's worse <laughs> I mean, I ain't too sore to where I can't move around, but every time I move, you know what I mean, I can feel it. But, uh, like, my shoulders, I keep on still stretching my shoulders, you know. Like, I should have never, and, and I did four sets of the 80 in arm, you know, and I did it on one, two, three, three different machines, you know, because everything, almost everything's, uh, machines at the uh, uh, gym that I'm going to, but uh, I mean, we, there's like free weights and stuff there, but like I said, I didn't want to do too much, you know, on my first few days just starting out, so like I said, I only did, worked on them machines. And that's not counting the, you know, the lift core. And then yesterday, the bicycles. And then I did, I did four machines of abs. And then three machines of chest. So, and like I did before, I used to work on abs every, I would, I would do my cardio, get my, you know, well, do the stretches, do my cardio, you know what I mean? To get my blood up and pumping and going. And then I would do abs and then whatever else I was working on that day. Like I would work on abs and, and legs. And then the next day I would work on abs and shoulders and then abs and biceps and abs and chest. But I, I, I don't know why I do that. I don't know if anybody else does it. But, you know... It's how I've always worked out before, so that's how, you know, I started doing it this time also. And plus, you know, I mean, I'm still walking, you know what I mean? It ain't like I'm not walking at all. I'm still walking and getting, you know, a lot of exercise with that. And I think it's actually helping with my uh, blood disease, y'all, for real, the peripheral vascular disease. I feel so much better, but then again, I have felt a lot better since, you know what I mean, I've been in a warmer climate, it has been a lot better anyhow, so, but I'm thinking, I'm, I'm hoping that, you know, we're working out and getting back into shape, and, you know, I'm going to do, I'm getting ready to start a stricter diet, you know, not only just dieting of doing what I'm doing now, I am about to start a diet to where um, I think I like do some meal preps, and um, I'm pretty sure, but I gotta do a little bit more research. But I can do like rice with like uh, chicken in it and corn or you know what I mean um, I can also fry up the well not fry like because I'm not going to put it in butter or nothing like that I'm just going to brown it in the uh, skillet um, turkey uh, turkey burger because of course y'all know I don't eat red meat but um, then I'm going to like and then before I go you know what I mean do the workout I'll eat like you know what I mean some fruit or something and then I plan on getting like a um, a uh, drink that you know is high in like protein and, and um, carbs you know what I mean so we will see how that goes, but like I said, I'm going to do a 90-day transformation, and I am going to take you guys along with me the whole ride, so you guys can see as it changes, and like, I don't really want to lose a lot of weight, 
because it will take off of well actually I probably ain't gonna lose much weight because the you know what I mean if you don't know muscle weighs more than fat you know what I'm saying so if I turn the fat into muscle it's gonna weigh more see what I'm saying so I mean, I'm sure I'm going to lose some because, you know, I'll lose the fat out of my stomach and, you know, some of the fat other places I have it, but, you know, I'm also going to be turning stuff into muscle as well. So, it's not going to be like a drastic drop, you know what I mean? Like last time I weighed myself, y'all seen, I weighed 305. So, I want to get down to around 250 maybe because I'm 6'1", so I think 250 is probably a good weight. So you need to drop like 50 pounds. And then 50 pounds is probably my stomach. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, y'all. I'm just kidding. Yeah, my belly don't weigh that much. Jeez, comedy. I hope not. Um, but, yeah, so that's what we're going to do in... Uh, I probably won't be going to the gym until later on this evening. So this video probably won't be out until this evening. After I go to the gym, get home, and showered up, or I don't know if I'm going to shop, maybe I'll shower at the gym, I don't know yet. But either way, after I get showered up and I edit the video, and then it will be uploading. So as soon as I get all that done... It will be uploaded. So, all right, y'all. You uh, hang in there, and I will see you soon. Well, it's going to be a couple seconds for you, but a few hours for me. So, if I, it, I might just uh, record some while I'm walking also. So, I will see you soon. All right, guys. Hang in there. What is up, Schizo fam? What is cracking locking? How is everybody doing today? Well, I hope you are doing very, very well. If not... Maybe I could put a little smile on your first. On your first. Oh my goodness, I already can't talk. First sentence into the vlog. Should I cut it out? Nah. I don't want it. Everybody makes mistakes, right? I'm only human, y'all. I think. My mom do kind of look kind of like an alien sometimes. No, I'm just kidding. I love you, mom. No. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I hope y'all are having a good day. It is Tuesday, so yo, you got one more day, and then you'll be over to hump day. There you go. See? Maybe you're smiling about that. Well, guys, I am sorry. Uh, last night when I went to the gym, um, I thought I grabbed this, but I didn't. All I grabbed was my phone and, you know, I my headphones, of course, because I listen to music when I work out. Um, and I'm like, darn. But, you know, um, when you first start working out, it's like almost like a struggle anyway, so, but I, I, I push myself, you know, uh, last night I did, um, I did straight up abs, like, the whole time, you know, like, I, I did it until my abs was absolutely killing me, so, and, uh, I was actually on the phone with my internet guy yesterday for two hours. Well, not my internet guy, my internet people, and it was a lady. I don't know where she was from, but she spoke. I mean, her English wasn't bad. She was pretty good. I could understand her very well. The only thing is, is like, I don't know, like everything. First thing, I told her my name, spelled it for her even. And she keeps on telling me, like, like 45 minutes at a time with this. She keeps on telling I can't find your account. And I'm telling her all this other stuff. And then, um, I'm like, well, did you make sure you got my spelling right of my name and that? And here, she took the N off of my name and put nothing. She's 
like, oh, that's why. Here's your account right here. It popped right up with your whole name. Well, no crap. Oh, man. Sometimes I, I if, listen, somebody needs to vent something or you can reach the phone, through the phone and smack somebody upside the head for being dumb. <laughs> man. I hate that. I'm sorry, I don't like to talk about people behind their back or nothing, but listen, this this lady, she was something else, man, something else. And then what made me the maddest is what I was trying to do was, you know, got a really good router in my house. I was trying to tell them to, I wanted to use it, you know. And she keeps on telling me she can't find my router. Like, I gave her everything on the back of this router. And she was like, are you near the desktop? Uh, desktop? And I was like, yeah, but it's not going to work if the internet ain't coming through. Well, she says, you don't need the internet for this. What? Okay. So I get on the laptop and she says, no, um, pull up a brow, um, you know, one of the things. So I pulled up Google. Google. Man, I can't talk. Google Chrome. And she says, put in, you know, one dot, blah, 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 a whole set of numbers, you know, dots and numbers. And she said, okay, and I'll push enter. And I push enter. And it comes straight up. Site not available, internet with no internet connection. And I have told her, I said, well, what do you know? Man, I hate, I hate whatever, like, you know something and they won't listen to you. So listen, I mean, that takes 10, 15 minutes right there. Just, you know what I mean? Go to the, uh, you know what I mean? Turn it on. Let it boot up. Blah, blah, blah. Wow. And then, you know, she finally tells me. And, you know, I probably shouldn't do it. Listen, I was screaming at her after she tells me this. Well, we sent out your, um, your route, our router for you on, on, um, last Thursday. So you should be getting it. So I advise you to wait for that. Listen, I was hot when she said that. You know, I like I, I told I should I should have just stayed with my old internet provider. You know what I mean? The only reason why is because um I I got it FIOS and like it was dirt cheap. Like you know what I mean? I got all the stuff like dirt cheap the guy gave me whenever he did all of my stuff. So I did it and you know now it's been like almost two weeks still no internet guys i am about to go crazy and look i will be calling the technician today again when i get home and i hope i don't get that lady oh my goodness if i get her i will hang up and call back if i i would hang up and call back a hundred times if i kept getting her on the phone <laughs> but anyway so I don't know if I told you guys but like my diet that I want to start only consists of like like I want to do like a meal prep okay like just cook a bunch of rice you know and get them containers from Walmart they're really cheap get them containers from Walmart so I could do the meal prep so all I gotta do is pop them in a microwave or whatnot. So um man guys I don't know what's wrong with me today. I can't think I can't talk. <sighs> okay so all I do is you know cook a bunch of rice up uh you know and I wanna bake the chicken breast you know baked is always better for you than fried of course um 
And you know what fried chicken will get you? It's the skin. That's what gets you with fried chicken, y'all, believe it or not. But that's the best part. If you're eating fried chicken, you can't take the skin off. You got to eat it. No, taking the skin off and throwing it away. No, 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 no. Listen, I got a story for you guys. I try to tell you this. But anyway, I want to bake my chicken. I, I, and, um, I don't know if y'all remember, I do not eat red meat. So, um, my ground meat is actually ground turkey. And, like, it, listen, when you make it, you can't even tell the difference, for real. For real, you can't. Like, a chili or, um, spaghetti or, I mean, anything. You cannot tell the difference, y'all. If I didn't tell you, hey, that's ground turkey, you wouldn't know. You know what I mean? Like, whenever I was still in Pennsylvania, uh, my neighbors come over for dinner, and we had um, uh, homemade hamburger helper. It was just like, um, you know, you make uh, elbow noodles and, you know, put uh, cheese in it, and then, you know, uh, the ground-up turkey, you know, or... You know, or ground meat, you know, if that's what you want. And uh, my neighbor, like, I, I, I knew him all my life, you know what I mean? I went to school with him since, like, kindergarten. But uh, I told him, I said, Vic, I was like, that's ground turkey. He was like, man, this is really good. You can't even tell. I was like, I told you. I told you. You can't even tell. But anyway, so in some, I want to put, you know, uh, pieces of the you know cut it up the chicken up and put like chunks of it in the rice with either I want to do some with corn some with green beans in the same way with the um, ground turkey you know to rice the ground turkey and either corn or green beans you know both you know so and I gotta measure it but I gotta find out you know how much it's supposed to be like what the measurement is because it's an actual diet y'all I, I can't remember the name of the diet but if you guys know it uh put in the comments down below please i really appreciate it or if you guys know a um diet with the rice and you know what i mean or the meal prep or whatever you know um let me know if it's a pretty good one i mean I, i'll try it you know like i'm not trying that you know, I still want to have, like, you know what I mean? I want to get, still I want to get, um, like, uh, carbs and, you know, everything that way. You know, because I don't want to lose too much weight. You know, because I don't want to be small. You know? you know what I'm saying? Like, that's not me. <laughs> you know? So... Yeah, I want to do that. But, uh, yeah, if you guys have any ideas, Jim, seriously, put it down below. But um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, end this video, guys. So do me a favor and share the video. Smash that like button. And if you're new, hit subscribe. And when you hit subscribe, see that little bell down there? Hit that little bell. Hit that little bell. And every time that I upload a video, it is going to light up. It's going to vibrate. It's going to ring. It's going to ring a ling ding dong. It's going to sing you a song. It's going to do whatever your stuff's supposed to do every time you get a notification. That's right, y'all. Sounds easy, don't it? That's because it is, so just hit your notifications, turn it on, so every time Schizo Steve uploads a video, you know about it. And with me, you never know what it's going to be. All right, y'all, this is Schizo Steve. I hope you guys have a great, great, a wonderful day, and I am out for now, but I will catch you later.